Banana smoothie for the win. This is glass number two of an eight banana smoothie. Why not use nice looking cups, nice looking beer jugs for smoothies? Easily done, eight bananas, quarter cup of sugar, about 300, 400 milliliters of water, and about a half a cup of frozen berries. Delicious. So on my way to work, about 200 calories of dry bananas in the pocket. Easy work food, easy fun, so let's do it. Jam sandwich number one. Just Ezekiel bread and a little bit of jam. Some for the ants. Jam sandwich. Number two. So why not just explore on the bike? Start trying try to just try to commute on the bike wherever you're going. Try to commute on the bike. Just explore. If you don't have a bike, just walk. Walk somewhere you've never been before. Get lost on campus. Get lost in your town. Go down a street you've never gone down before. Just have fun. Life's such a journey. When you make life a journey, when you make exercise a part of the day, you don't need to go to the gym. You don't need to do any of that. You make training a part of your lifestyle. You make moving your body a part of your lifestyle. Save money on a gym membership. Food for thought. So what we did here, is just put some water, organic water, put it in the jam, swish it up, and put it in here. Easily done, easily done, easily done. And blend. Blend again. More large bananas, a little bit of excess jam in the jar, 300 milliliters of water, and five strawberries. Just a quick banana snack. So this is a pretty good metaphor for life. So trying to switch off the saddles here. Don't know what I'm doing. Never done this before. But it's a bit, a bit like life. It's better to take action than to not take an action at all. So I'm going to figure this out. See you in a bit. Success? So we got a pound of pasta, a can of those tomatoes, and a whole lot of love. This thing is almost as big as my hand. Easily, easily, easily done. Simply vegan, simply, simply delicious, delicious foods. So you can see here the easiness, the beauty, the simplicity. The awesome carb power of a high carb diet. 19 grams of fat, 77 grams of protein. Do you see any protein foods on here? No, all carbohydrate based. But if you eat enough carbohydrate calories, you're gonna get enough fat, you're gonna get enough protein. Not an issue. So let's look down. Shall we? Vitamins, crazy, crazy good, crazy, crazy good. B12, I commented about that before. Uh, vitamin D, also commented that before. Get out in the sun. No need to worry about the vitamin D. Minerals, super, super good, super fantastic. Fat, good, 19 grams for the day. Pretty good, pretty solid, pretty low. Now protein, where do you get your protein on a vegan diet? I don't know. I... I I can't tell you. I don't know. I don't know where a gorilla gets his. I don't know where a cow gets hers. I don't know where a tangy jaybird gets his. Huh. 
Very weird. Very weird. So let me know in the comments below what you guys think. I'm trying to make these videos shorter than the last ones. Is that a good thing? Is it not a good thing? Let me know. What you really know. And let me know what you guys want to see um, in general. If you like these kind of videos, give this video a thumbs up. Let me know. Also, let me know in the comments if you like these videos. If you like the banana flavored hair, give this video a thumbs up. So, subscribe if you want to see more of these videos. I got plenty of others, plenty of others, plenty of others. And uh, what else do we want to say? I think that's about it. Let me know if there's something that you have a question on, a food item. While we're doing these food videos, if you want me to eat something in particular or answer a question on some particular food, just let me know in the comments. I'll answer it. So this is Simply Vegan signing out. We'll see you tomorrow for another day, another carb day. Remember, get your carbs in today because the carbs are...